I grew up in Williston, North Dakota. Moved to Haver in the fourth grade because my dad was uh, a railroader and he was transferred here. I went to barber school in Spokane. I came back to Haver and started my own barber shop. I cut hair for about 35 years. Uh, Ronald, I met uh, one of my clients, introduced me to her. I need a haircut. She also needed an accountant, so kind of got to know each other that way, and later on we started dating. I guess I really paid attention to how much those accounting bills were, and I thought, I better marry him, because I don't think I can afford to pay him that much. <laughs> the most people on the outside were pretty much opposites. Everything is a joke with Renell, whereas, you know, I'm pretty quiet, pretty reserved. You can tell we're a little different. We get on each other's nerves once in a while, but it works for us. I played uh, a lot of city league volleyball. My sports bras, I really couldn't find anything on the market that worked for me. Long story short, I went to my mother, because she's a pretty good seamstress, and I said, we need to make something that'll work, because what I'm finding isn't working. Two years later, I ended up with a pat. I spent a long time contacting companies to see if they were interested in my design. I pretty much got the forum letter from everybody saying, you know, that's great, good luck to you, and no thank you. I knew in my heart that I couldn't be the only one out there with this problem. And I knew there had to be a lot of women that I'd be able to help with this. I just decided, all right, I'll just do it myself. Because I'm full blooded Norwegian and it's hard to tell a Norwegian anything. So I just decided to do it.